Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the Patreon podcast. Uh, This week, I wanted to talk about something I'm doing right now, which is active procrastination. Um, I have a very bad habit of if there's something that I don't want to do, I fill my plate up with other things. Um, And while this is a great way to get things done, it's not a great way to get the thing that you need done. Um, I have a commission that I'm working on and I just really am not enthusiastic about it right now. And it's nothing against the, the people that I'm working with. They're awesome. They're awesome guys, but just don't want to do it. Um, so I'm recording this and honestly, over the past two months or so, I've just been throwing myself at different projects, regardless of whether that's the Nasso Elmo or if it was prepping a bunch of albums for release this year, or if it was starting a game jam (laughs) or like right now where I actually have time to do it now that the deadline is starting to rapidly approach. Um, I'm recording a podcast and then I will most likely go out and shovel snow. Um, so obviously I'm not doing very good at it, but I am aware of what I'm doing. Um, and essentially what this is, is like, it's procrastinating, but it's procrastinating in a way that doesn't make you feel as guilty, which really isn't an excuse. Um, but honestly, I just wanted to kind of raise the awareness on this because this is something that I don't think is just, uh, something that I specifically do. I'm sure a lot of people do this as well. And I, I, I want you to kind of look and see, like, is it possible that there's something that you're not doing or that you feel like you can't do? So you're filling your time with other things. Uh, personally, I kind of feel that if I don't have enough information on what I'm trying to do, um, I, I get kind of mind locked on it and I don't know how to like proceed. Um, and you know, with commissions, sometimes that is uh, pretty common where in this case, they're just like, Hey, make a, make a song that sounds, um, like this genre of game and they don't really reference any specific songs. And then you're like, well, that, that doesn't really narrow things down that much. So, uh, in my case, I need to go back and get some clarification on stuff, but it, in general, I feel that it's really valuable to kind of understand when you're actively procrastinating, because that'll allow you to put aside time to, to work on it. And, and one of the things that you can do with this is the Pomodoro technique, which is essentially, uh, setting a timer for 15 minutes or 30 minutes and working, like dedicating that 30 minutes to work. And hopefully you kind of get momentum and you get moving on the thing and then you can just finish it. Um, but if it doesn't work, at least you tried and then you can move on from there. And honestly, I should have been doing this for the last, two months, (laughs) but I've been, you know, focused on so many other things. And I kind of just realized that I was putting this off. And like I said, I, my deadline for it is, is rapidly approaching. I've got like four days left. So I just need to sit down and do it. Um, and I, I, I'm struggling and it sucks, but you know, that's kind of just the nature of how this works. Creativity is not necessarily a spigot you can turn on and off as much as I'd like to think that it is. It's something that requires, you know, some active participation sometimes. And and, I, and I'm getting there, but it's just frustrating. Um, anyway, I like that's really it. Like, I just wanted to kind of bring awareness to this because I don't think a lot of people really think about it this way where it's just like, Oh, I'm getting a lot done, but I'm not getting what I need done. Um, and it, it's kind of revisiting your priorities or if, if you're like doing a lot of things and it's not the thing that you need, um, kind of reevaluate why you're stuck. Um, like in my case, I don't have enough, uh, proper feedback to, uh, generate the sounds and songs that I need. Um, and in your case, it might be a, an issue with knowledge or skill or something, and that might require practice. And, you know, you don't want to do that because practice sucks, but you know, that's part of the process. Um, and you know, I, I think that it's important to realize when this is happening so you can kind of diagnose why it's happening. So yeah, I think that's it. Um, Thank you so much for listening. I really genuinely do appreciate it. I hope that you have a fantastic Friday and a wonderful weekend, and I will talk to you in the next one. Be remarkable.